I'm Mungshal Park. This is the Great British Chef Signature Series. When I was 11 years old, I fell in love with the bread. And then that was the start, the actual beginning to being interested with cooking and baking. I tried one day to bake it. And then I just quickly realized I don't like it because I have to measure everything. And my personality is not like that meticulous. So um, just uh, naturally, just my interest in moved to cuisine. Hi, um, my name is Park, Ungchal Park, actually. We are at the restaurant Solip nearby London Bridge Station. I'm gonna cook today um, our third snacks, which we call um, Gamte Sandwich. So um, it's very simple, simple dish, actually simple item. I will call it item because it's not proper dish. We need only brioche and then duck catch carefully cheese from Somerset and gamte and butter. So first step is you get a slice of brioche. And then we have got um, Gamte butter, which is a mix of gamte and butter from France. So um, you spread gamte butter into um, brioche. That's one, actually, one sandwich. That's another sandwich, which is six portions each. And then you get gamte, which is dried seaweed from South Korea. And um, Cheese, duck it carefully. I love cheese. When I came to the UK and London first time, I used Nisha dairy of course a lot, and then also La Fromagerie in Maribon. The British is the best in the world. So you just kind of um, doing Tetris and then make it like proper square, because this kind of a simple item, especially you. It's more important to make a good balance, always. And then you put the other one on top, and that's it. That's done. What we do is we make it, and then we wrap it up, and then we keep it in the fridge at least 24 hours to set it up by itself. So after 24 hours, We cut all the edge nicely. I love taste. I love bread. I love sandwich, everything. And then this one is special for me. So I have got six portions of this gamte sandwich. One portion is like that small. And I'm gonna pan sear it. And then as soon as you pan sear it, we're gonna warm it up in the oven, that's set, and ready to eat. At this stage, it's important to put the correct amount of the oil because you don't want to make a dried sandwich or oil soggy sandwich. And then you gotta cook, um, you gotta pan sear it, uh, color it in the right temperature. Otherwise, if you do too, um, too high temper, it's gonna be burnt. Otherwise, it's gonna be soggy. Too. Like I said, so um, it's very simple, but sometimes people forget about it. So, so you have um, pan seared, and I'm gonna put it in the oven. So I put one minute and 45 seconds, 180 degrees, 60% of steam. So that's a, that's a small um, bowl for gamte, and then that's Irish moss. We wash it every day, and then before we serve it, we, we spray it one more time with water. Otherwise, it gets dry very quick. A little, little fabric from Korea. So here you go. Let's uh, wrap it up with a gamte, slice of gamte. Actually, we cut just the right size we want. Here you go, our gum test sandwich, which is our third snack of tasting course.